And at 877, Rodolfo Hernandez Suarez expects to win the House of Naringo. Hernandez is a civil engineer and a businessman, the leader of the League of Anti-Corruption Political Movement. He was mayor of Bucaramanga in 2016, but could not end his mandate because of an investigation by Attorney General's office. Rodolfo Hernandez was born in Pio de Cuesta, southeast of Bucaramanga, on March 26, 1945, the year in which President Alfonso López Pumarejo resigned. López Pumarejo's elections are considered the last peaceful one in Colombia's recent history. The candidate is currently facing a criminal trial for irregularities on a $196 million contract for the management of solid waste, which sought to favor the Vitalogic company. His son, Luis Carlos Hernández, would have been bribed if the company had gotten the contract. One of the most notorious scandals of Hernández's administration was the blow he gave to Councilman John Claro for which he got suspended from the mayor's office for eight months. The electoral campaign of candidate Rodolfo Hernández continues despite doubts and the investigation. In September 2019, with only three months before his term was over, Hernández resigned from the mayor's office because the attorney general's office once again suspended him for allegedly participating in politics in favor of the candidate and current mayor of Bucaramanga, Juan Carlos Cárdenas. Businessman and civil engineer Rodolfo Hernández, a well-known realtor, aspires to succeed President Iván Duque. The criminal trial against the former mayor of Bucaramanga, who pleaded not guilty, is scheduled to begin on July 21st.